very much. Do you accept a blue card from Mr. Arnott? Yes. Mr. Arnott, please. I know you agree with me that torture is immoral, illegal and must always be condemned. Do you also accept that military expediency requires the possibility of proper interrogation? I refer in the UK to the words of Colonel Tim Collins, who said this, Since I was serving, the rules on interrogations have been tightened up because of the lawyers. We are no longer able to carry out tactical questioning. The effect of the ambulance chasing lawyers and the play at safe judges is that we have got to the point we have lost our operational capacity to do tactical questioning. Mr. Abbott, you have 30 seconds. It doesn't help if you speak so quickly that the translators can't translate your text because the colleagues won't understand it. Please, colleagues, can I just remind all of you to speak at a speed because it's the third time in this debate already that makes your, what you're saying intelligible to everybody else. Um, did you get the question? You didn't get it, huh? Um, so we'll move on. Um, Cecilia, but you have the opportunity to answer the bits that so you understood. So the question, and I will be happy to answer the brutality of the methods used and, and how they have been justified is simply unacceptable. And the European member states must all come together to disclose the truth. What happened in your country as well as in my country. This is the truth and we need to see it now. And it's time for impunity to come to an end, even in Europe.